the quick change wraps are also a great product in case of enlarged scrotums and scrotal edema. Far more effective than the typical sheets and towels approach used and without any of the cleaning agents like bleach that can further irritate this sensitive skin. For edemas, the quick change is wrapped around the penis and scrotum in an open cone bowl shape. Besides absorbing the urine, this approach will be doing two additional things. We're capturing any perspiration, excretion, or seepage from the swollen scrotum, which is usually red, raw, painful, and sensitive to moisture. And you're preventing the scrotum from migrating down in between the legs. Let's walk through our two methods. We'll start with a medium or large edema about the size of a large grapefruit. Make sure you treat the underside of the scrotum with any type of barrier cream or zinc spray that you have or whatever your protocol is for protecting that sensitive skin from urine. We're going to take two quick change wraps and create one large wrap by connecting the two ends using the Velcro tabs. Don't worry about the location at first, the Velcro will go anywhere on the backing and we're going to be adjusting the size of the quick change to accommodate your patient. So, make your double size wrap and place it on your patient's abdomen, flipping the two legs upwards to get them out of the way and help you slide the wrap gently into place. Gently lift up the scrotum, separating it from the legs while taking the pointed side and bringing it under between the scrotum and the legs. Now take the straight Velcro side and using the pointed side as a lever, you're going to pull them together slightly and attach the two together. Make sure this attachment is secure. Now you have a circular wrap. To make it as comfortable and effective as possible, you've got to tighten the sides. You won't be able to do this from the bottom, so take the two ends towards the head and pull them together towards each other. You'll see that the wrap becomes a bowl, as you can see from this angle. To recap, we are doing three things here. We're capturing urine on the top because the penis is resting against the wrap. We're capturing any perspiration or seepage from the swollen scrotum. And we're preventing the scrotum from migrating back down in between the legs. If you're concerned about your patient's linens or clothes, just attach another wrap over the top so you can keep that circulation going without fear of any urine coming over the top. Make sure to give it a good pinch. If the edema is closer to the size of an orange, only one wrap is required. Place the wrap on the abdomen with the white absorbent side up. Again, make sure the round edge is towards the head of the body and that the two flaps are towards the legs. Legs to legs. Slide the wrap down so that the inner ring is as low towards the base of the shaft as possible or, if totally retracted, the tip of the penis. Gently lift the scrotum up, separating it from the legs. Using the pointed side as a lever, you're going to place it under the scrotum. Then fold the second side over slightly, pulling upwards. Like last time, you want to make sure that there is a snug, semi-tight fit at the base of the genitals to prevent possible leakage. Then make sure to pinch the hook fastener and inner flap together to get good adhesion. If you have any additional questions on the quick change wrap and how it can be more effective for your usage, you can find us at our website, quickchange.com, where we have several videos on the wraps as well as various materials and instruction guides for downloading. We also offer virtual in-servicing live from our broadcast studio over platforms such as Zoom and Skype, where you and your team can interact with our clinical educators. Feel free to call us anytime at 1-800-206-2816, where we can walk you through any situation.